Tommy Parker for Vicksburg Daily News. Joining me is Vicksburg South Ward Alderman Alex Monsoor Jr. Thank you for your time, Mr. Monsoor. Good to be with you. Um, the reason I've asked for this time, I filed a Freedom of Information request uh, with the city clerk's office regarding the situation with LDs. And one of the things that I found by filing this Freedom of Information request is the fact that you did not sign this memorandum of understanding. That's correct. Uh, would you care to elaborate on your position? Well, the first M MOU, which is the memorandum of understanding on the uh, incident that happened previously, uh, there were some shootings in there. And um, so we did the understanding that they would um, in increase security and they said they would and uh, they were I think they installed panels, so they paddles or something, so they could try to metal detectors and stuff. But so it said that they would watch the inside and the outside. Okay, so fast forward to recently, we're doing it. We're looking to do another MOU, which I didn't sign because it's, it's not even as severe as I think it should be. Number one. Uh, so when you have five shoot, shot in one end and then three at the other, and you have one fatality. It just, in my opinion, uh, and I'm friends with uh, LD, have been for a long time, but uh, something has got to be done. And just changing who's going to be managing your bar um, from one MOU to the other is just, to me, I don't, I just can't see it working. I just, uh, you know, you have a, an, a, you know, back in the day, many years ago, everybody fist fought. Now they're just pulling out guns and shooting. And um, I just I just didn't think I could sign that for the interest of the people in the city of Vicksburg at this time. You uh, have been closely aligned with, with Mayor Flags. You and him have a long relationship. Obviously, you have a different opinion on, on this matter. He and Alderman Mayfield signed this. Looking back, I also have the one from um, 2018, all three of you signed this one. There don't appear to be a whole lot of differences in the language in these two documents. Yeah, it's really not. But so, you know, with me coming in in 2017 and us dealing with um, uh, them on the first MOU, I gave them a chance, you know, to do it, do it better. And uh, it's just, it's turned out to be that you know, we're turning around doing the same thing. You know, the definition of insanity. You just keep doing things over and over again, and it's not, it's just not working. But um, I just believe that this warrants um, a more strenuous, um, I don't have a problem with anybody operating and serving food and selling lunches, whatever. But this right here uh, seems to be a recipe for something bad happening. And um, so I just couldn't find myself to vote for it this time. Um, and like I said, everybody's got their own you know, conscience to go with, but I just couldn't do it, could not do it. For point of clarification, uh, I did approach Mr. Prentice earlier today and offered him the opportunity to do an interview with me. Uh, he declined, he said maybe at a later date, but uh, this had been brought to my attention when, when, when the word got out last week that there was going to be a new memorandum, and as I said, I filed a, a Freedom of Information request to the uh, city clerk's office, and this afternoon I received both documents, the, the previous one and this one, and I felt it incumbent to approach you and, and find out and give you an op opportunity to uh, tell your position. Well, you know, if anything I do, um, y'all are welcome to come ask me about it. I'm not shy about telling you what, why I did anything most of the time, uh, you know, uh, it's nothing that's going to really upset much of the apple cart around here because what we do in the majority of this city is good. Uh, job creation and improvements downtown, infrastructure, but this one is just, uh, it, it's me personally. I look at the situation, I'm looking at the two MOUs, and I just don't see uh, enough to warrant me looking to sign that thing again. So I just didn't sign it and that's my position on it. So
And we have to do something in line with the shooting and, you know, and going on Vicksburg. We talk about it all the time in the meetings. Y'all are there. So uh, this is my way of saying, hey, we got to do something about it. Thank you, sir. Thank you for your time. You're welcome.